NASCAR's critics say the sport is just cars going around in circles. Well, not this week. The typical NASCAR recipe has a lot of spice added at Sonoma. A 10 turn, 1.99 mile road course with major elevation changes. It's a place that often generates some of the most enjoyable, dramatic racing of the season. And with Marco Sambers back home in Australia, it's anybody's race. There aren't too many hot topics coming out of a NASCAR off week, so let's talk about Dale Earnhardt Jr. No, not because he got engaged last week, although that's great, but Earnhardt, who once wanted to blow up Sonoma because he hated it so much, has been getting better and better there. He scored his first top 10 finish last year, and that was a third place finish. Jeff Gordon is by far Sonoma's all-time winner with five victories. No one else has more than two, four drivers are tied with that for second, and Gordon has the most top fives top tens, poles, laps led, and the best average finish. You get the idea. Gordon is really good at Sonoma. But Gordon isn't our pick to win. Who is? AJ Allmendinger, who led the most laps at last year's Sonoma race before hitting the wall, then won the Watkins Glen Road Race in August. With Ambrose gone, Allmendinger is NASCAR's best road racer and needs a win to make the chase. He will get it done on Sunday.